So at Flintlock, there are two facets of the medical efforts. On the real world side, we're providing direct medical care to all of our participants. So that includes roll one, like sick call type care. It also includes roll two at all of our training sites. So emergency surgical care. Interoperability is a key portion of delivering seamless, effective medical care. And so Flintlock offers us a great opportunity to practice this interoperability. And then another benefit to training with our partners is to share best practices. We're very proud of what we've done in the U.S. military system. But at the same time, our partners are living in their own AORs and have developed advances and have adapted to their specific needs uh, and threats in their region. So this is our chance to listen to them and learn from what they have learned um, in their AORs. I'm here at Tomale Air Force Base in Tomale, Ghana, um, in support of Exercise Flintlock 23. I'm responsible for the routine um, healthcare day-to-day -day of the participants, um, both the trainees and the mentors here, as well as providing um, emergency medical care as needed. We also had a small class slash introduction with the um, EMTs, the emergency medical technicians here, um, just to try and cross-level our and ensure like a mutual understanding between um, responsibilities and capabilities. While I'm here at Flintlock 23, um, hope to learn a little bit more about uh, African culture, learn a little bit more about austere medicine. It's kind of fun to be treating patients of different cultures and ethnicities and uh, backgrounds in a different country.